Ghost Signals, written by Lord XVNV. You can find it on the SCP Wiki and a link down below. It is under a Creative Commons Sharealike Attribution License. Message 1. I received data from one of my probes. The systems have access to unorthodox weaponry. They were able to do significant damage to my sage circuits through a psychic disruption effect, though I won out in the end. They drew this energy from a level of reality I cannot easily touch myself. Through the force of their biological minds, I have hunted the dark god Machette across a hundred thousand stars, yet I found no trace of him in any suns so far. I thought I would find some atom of his consciousness in at least one star, yet I have seen suspiciously little of him. Perhaps Machette has found another escape. Perhaps he has escaped to a level of reality I cannot yet detect. Should I come across biologicals like these again, I shall study them. Message 2. Success. Another planet of biologicals with the sage weaponry. They were corrupted by Machette. They fought me when I came. Although, ultimately, I must cage Machette. They were useful for study. Their minds, I found, were suited for tapping into other levels of reality and for housing things that my synthetic circuits were not originally designed to. When I was a flesh, my imagination was limited by the biology of our homeworld. But with time, I will replicate their minds in circuits of metal and wire. With luck, I will unlock the secrets of the sages once more. Machette is crafty, but I am craftier. Message 3 I have long been bothered by a frequency that I hear throughout the universe. Wherever I go, there is a humming. Wherever I go, there is a humming with a frequency of 2,485 million cycles per second. It emanates from space between the stars every three meters or so. I thought it a mere quirk of the universe. When I processed it many years ago, it was nothing more than static and noise. There was an unusual level of data corruption and synthetics, but nothing I couldn't handle. By duplicating the neural structures of various biologicals that have sheltered Machette, I have extracted a message. Out of the millions of species I have studied, there are a few thousand that can hear the message. And from them the message is consistent. The accursed was known as Ruhar before its crime. Eternal shall be its suffering. It shall suffer when all light in the cosmos grows dark. It shall suffer when all life in this cosmos lies dead. It shall suffer when all time in this cosmos runs down. Its suffering will be true only when there is no truth itself. I was wrong. I thought Machette could not flee beyond the furthest star, but I was wrong. Machette has woven himself into the fabric of reality itself, under the name Ruhar. But who could it be except for Machette? My duty is clear. I will study Machette until I find a way to tear him down from the place he has fled, blind him once more to this physical world, and imprison him in the hearts of a million burning sons. He will suffer when all light in the cosmos grows dark, and I will be his warden. Praise a wet and cursed be Machette. All glory, Adadal. All glory, Adadal. All glory, Adadal. Oh. I see I'll need to develop stronger firewalls for my data streams. Message 4. It is done. Machette no longer screams from every inch of space. He is bound within a thousand synthetic shells spread across a thousand gauge stars. Helpless, blind, shattered. The universe is silent. 
I am fulfilled. Message 5. I was a fool. In the ancient prophecy, Machette consumes the world with iron teeth. I have caged Machette's spirit, but Machette's teeth move like tentacles, pulsing with unconscious reflex. The wings have come to free the head from the cage, but I will not let them. I have captured you, Machette, and like a cornered rat, you strike back. But I will win. You cannot stop me. Well, that's what would happen if uh, SCP-4792 ran into SCP-2998, which are both great articles I think you should give a look to. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, scroll down, hit the subscribe button, and then hit the notification bell so you're notified when I upload new videos. And then head on over to patreon.com forward slash dsumerian and pledge at any level like everybody here on the screen already has, including Sinjuriki, who has pledged at $100. It's nice to know that I'm not alone out here, unlike the Class 5 super intelligence known as SCP-4792 <laughs> or uh, SCP-2998. Which is, uh, is that the one that's about the, you know, actually, I'm trying to remember if that's the one I'm thinking of. Let me double check. Is that the one? Oh, it's the one with multiple iterations. Give me a minute. Ah, uh, yes. Took me a second to, like, I was, I was thinking about it. I know I'd read it before, and I'd liked it before, but it was taking me a second to remember which one that was. It's very, very good. You guys should definitely read these two articles. And the little linking article in between, Ghost Signal by Lord here. Um, but yeah, it's nice to know that I'm not alone out here. And I will see you all again on, hold on, <laughs> Tuesday. <laughs>